Well, Alaskans and visitors alike flocked to the Kenai River during the summertime to experience world-class fishing. But it was a different prized possession that was hooked by a traveler who was recently visiting her son from the East Coast. Now, Dave Finocchio was hosting his mother on her trip from Massachusetts, and her vacation included a couple of fishing endeavors. On Friday, they decided to head down to the Kenai. Fish were caught, but so too was an item that had been lost to the river days earlier. An iPhone inside an otter box, battery dead, but phone still intact overall. You can see it there. The pair charged it up and eventually got in touch with the owner after posting about the phone online. Saw a picture of two folks on the screen, and so I said, well, I don't know who they are, but I'll take a picture and post it on Facebook and see if anybody knows them. And cert, uh, I'd say a few hours later, um, maybe 12 hours later, his mother, the owner's mother, uh, reached out and said, hey, that's my son. I lost it with him four days ago in the river. And so the phone was in the river for four days. And I messaged him, and we met up later that evening. And he came by and picked it up, and it works. Hey, it's helpful to report lost and found items. Maybe some good karma in there, too. Alaska State Troopers Communications Director Austin McDaniel saying that the typical threshold for the agency tracking items is usually around 500 bucks. But if you find items such as government identification cards, like driver's licenses, military IDs, or passports, those should be reported, too, whether to AST or another local law enforcement agency. Now, if troopers know who an item belongs to, they'll try to reunite the item with its owner. And it may seem obvious, but keep in mind, firearms are particularly important items to report as lost or found. A serial number and photo are helpful in the events you can provide them. Uh, if you have one, you can turn it into any local law enforcement office. They'll take it uh, and hold on to it, try to locate whoever that owner is. Um, if you do lose a firearm, uh, one gets stolen from you, you definitely want to let law enforcement know in case that firearm is used in something nefarious down the road.